Hello, in this video I'm gonna try to help you fix the issues with DirectX errors in FC25. If you have troubles with launching the game or if you have this issue while in the main menu or something, then here's what you can do in order to fix this issue. So first and foremost, you should update drivers of your graphics card. The There is, for instance, for the GeForce graphics card an update. Uh, as you can see, we have a game ready for eSports FC25. So if you didn't update your graphics card yet, you should be able to do that. Make sure to uh, update the driver, whether it is NVIDIA or AMD or anything else. You should just open the app related to your graphics card and then look for the update. I also found this thread on Reddit where it is stated that you can try to put the game in windowed mode. And when you are in the start menu, you can press Alt and Enter on PC in order to use the windowed mode. For some people, apparently it helped. And there is also one guy that said that you should download the Xbox accessories in the Microsoft Store. And after that, you should be able to update your Xbox controller. So if you use Xbox controller, then this might be actually helpful. So try this out as well. And for some reason, this might be working and solving the issue as well. If this is relevant to you, you should also try the Intel driver and support assist. You should be able to download this app, install it, and then let it scan your PC. And then you should have the updated uh, installation available there. So after that, you should be able to run EA Sports FC25. You can also make sure that you have enough space in your C drive, especially in your C drive or wherever you have your uh, operating system or the, the, the disk that you have your game installed on. So for instance, if I have my game installed on D, you want to also make sure that you have some free space on D as well. And C, of course. And that's pretty much it. If your issue still continues, let me know in the comments and just if you can provide as much details as possible about the error and I will try to find the solution for you and make another video. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye.